All right, you guys. So that is not my official jingle, honey, okay? I just had to borrow that real quick. Anyways, I hope you guys are doing good this evening. I want to come on here and do my first official evening podcast. I had to take a nap earlier, honey, when I tell you I've been so dang on tired. You know, one thing about being a YouTuber and just doing social media stuff, your sleep pattern is so off, yo, it's ridiculous. It's like between researching and editing and talking to people and going through DMs and emails emails it's like your sleep pattern is so off so when you can get in a quick nap and get some you know beauty rest you just do that so I took a nice little nap earlier so now I'm ready to come on here and talk about a few things you know YouTube you know I'm trying to hang in there as you guys all know but I had to start my podcast I had to be able to speak freely about topics that I feel are somewhat important to me and I know YouTube is censoring us like crazy. It's insane. Even with the Nikki Tutorials um, video that I did, I felt like I was definitely being very fair to her. But if you guys know me, you guys know I will call out foolishness. And I felt so conflicted because the part about her not telling her current fiance, you know, her original gender, that bothered me. And I know it bothered a lot of people. I saw the comments. But it's like I had to like really you know, debate and argue with myself, like, do you even want to go there? Do you even want to bring this up? Because it's like, if I say something and, you know, people on YouTube get offended or the trans community, and she's a way bigger YouTuber than I am, I don't want people coming after my shit. I don't work hard for my channel, and I'm not about to lose my channel behind, you know, Nikki Tutorials or nobody. So I just kind of said, you know what, let's just stick to the topic at hand. I didn't even want to go there about her not telling her fiancé, but I know a lot of people are talking about that. But we'll do a whole nother show. I'm getting ready to schedule a show coming up soon, and we're going to really get into that. We're going to get into transitioning kids at early ages. I want to hear from the people. But like I said, it's just certain things we cannot hit on anymore on YouTube. If you you talk about certain influencers if they want they can run and say that you're bullying them and everything else so I'm just trying to stay out that fray okay I'm trying to bring you guys content but then still you know watch my steps so that's why I'm so happy that I have this podcast because now I can just kind of talk you know what I mean I can run my damn mouth okay how you doing you know I didn't have time yesterday but guess what <laughs> today I got time today I got time Yes, today I got time. So anyways, y'all, I want to come on here and talk about this really disturbing situation. I know this type of video is definitely a no-go on YouTube, so I want to bring it onto my podcast. So if you guys do not know, a lot of you guys were sending me DMs yesterday about a comedian. His name is Brad Williams, and he's a little person. And so what happened is that basically um, a 2014 clip that was taken from the Doug Benson show, it has resurfaced.